Hello, welcome back to my YouTube channel. For those of you who don't know, my name is LaShawn and I am happy. I'm a mother of three. I'm a U.S. Navy veteran and a surgical technologist. I'm home now and I, I um, use uh, my, my social media platforms like Facebook and YouTube to uplift and encourage. And I hope that uh, today I can uplift and encourage you. I'm just going to, to today, I just want to uh, say this prayer that was on my heart this morning. And that way, uh, that's the positive thing that I'll do today. I'll say how I'm feeling and I'll release it to God and I'll pray, but I'll post this because this prayer might actually help somebody today. And that is my goal. Uh, and uh, that's what I want to do. So uh, I hope this helps. Okay. Uh, Father, lately I've been feeling discouraged. Lately, I've been feeling like I'm not doing enough. And I ask you, Father, for your guidance. I ask you, Father, to please steer me in the right direction. I thought that my breakthrough was coming, Father. I thought that you was going to show me my breakthrough. I thought you were going to guide me to my breakthrough. And I've been waiting and waiting. And now I know while this wait was possible, Father. I know, Father. I know, Father. But I thank you for reminding me this morning that you allowed that delay. Thank you, Father. You allowed that delay. And even though I may not understand why I had to wait, Father, I understand now that your timing is and always will be perfect, Father God. I thank you, Father. I thank you for giving me another day, Father. I thank you for giving me the strength to wake up this morning, Father. So right now, today, at this very moment, Father, I just want to say that I love you. And I, I submit myself to you. I give myself to you because I know that you'll take care of me and you'll give me the strength that I need. So right now, today, I want to release any anger that I may have on my heart, Father God. I want to release anything that's holding me back, Father God. I want to release any anxiety. I want to unleash and release and release and release all the negativity, Father God. And I want to release all the worry that plagues my heart, Father God. Give me strength, Father. Because today, I want you to know I have trust in you, Father. I know that you will make things better, Father. I'm not going to lose my confidence. I'm not going to lose my faith, Father. I know that you're watching out for all of us and for all the people that are listening today on YouTube, Father. Touch their heart, Father God. I thank you for everything, Father God. I thank you for my life, Father. I thank you for watching over and protecting me, Father. I thank you for watching over and protecting my children, Father. I thank you for everything that you do for me, Father. This has been a difficult season, Father. And yet you stepped in and guided me in the right direction, Father God. And showed me everything in due time, Father God. I had to learn patience, Father God. I had to learn it all over again. I knew that you were going to make things better, Father. I knew that you had things planned for me, Father. And I thank you in advance. And I pray in Jesus' name. I just wanted to share that prayer with you this morning because I knew that that prayer was coming. I knew how I was feeling about what I was praying about. And uh, I can sit here all day and tell you to have faith and believe, but I have to believe that also in my heart. So I have to do things myself to uplift other people. So today I just want you to know that you matter. It matter God loves you uh, you're unique you are special 
and you're going to have a great day today. You're going to have a great day because you're going to go out there all prayed up. You don't already did that. That's what we just did this morning. We said our prayer this morning. So we know that we are surrounded, that we are lifted, and we will make it through today. No matter what may come up our way today. Because we started our day in prayer. That's the way to do it. Start and end your day with prayer. Thank you, Father. That's what you need to do. It helps you. I mean, this is just... We all have moments. And our my thing this morning was I wanted to pray. And I did. I, I prayed this morning. But I wanted to do that particular prayer and let you hear the words. Because it's, it's very important for people to understand that a lot of people that are positive are going through things themselves also. And they make a conscious effort to push and do that extra so they'll never get in that dark place again. And that, for me, that is what I do. I was in that dark place. So everything that I do helps me from falling back into the pit. That's what I call it, the pit of darkness, sadness, uh, depression, anxiety, all those things. So lift your head up a little more. <laughs> lift your head up and believe that today is going to be a good day. You know why? Because... You sat down and you prayed about your day. You sat down and you gave your problems to God this morning. And everything is going to be better. So believe that as you head out your door this morning, that today is going to be a good day. Okay, you ready? Breathe in and breathe out. That was a long one. I just want you to know that Today is the beginning of the rest of your life. Today is the beginning of the rest of your life. Tomorrow, don't, yesterday, yesterday. We start from the day we move forward. And that's why I said that. Okay, so smile. Remember to smile. You know, some of our smiles are better than others, but I'm holding on to my teeth as long as I can. But, uh... But when I have to, I will buy me some dentures, player, just so you know. And I, I ain't got no shame. I'm not wrapped up in all that, all that stuff. It don't matter. Okay, so smile, be happy, be joyful, and protect your peace at all costs today as you head out. And remember, remember that God loves you, and I love you too. Have a blessed day. Goodbye.